We've all been there, stuck in a rut, trying to find a solution to a problem that seems unsolvable. But what if I told you that the secret to unlocking your creative potential and finding innovative solutions lies in an unexpected place? Welcome back to ImproX, I am Ami Mandavia, founder of ImproX, the platform where we explore the science of developing a growth mindset, building productive habits, and what is required to live a healthy life. Where we dive deep into the art of productivity and personal growth and if you are looking for tools, tips, and techniques to improve your productivity this year, this video is for you. Before we dive in, let's clarify what procrastination really means. It's not about being lazy or avoiding work altogether. Instead, it's about embracing the art of strategic delay. Procrastination is basically the demonstration of postponing or putting off something yet we are taught that it's lethargic it's the enemy of success and accomplishment. You understand what you have missed the point. With an ever increasing number of difficulties in our lives, businesses and society demand an imaginative methodology. This blind focus on productivity is the enemy of development and innovativeness and creativity. Do you really want to invest more energy in enjoying productive procrastination is about using it cleverly as an instrument it can truly get you improved results. Ancient Egyptians had two words for procrastination the first one is destructive laziness and that is the definition most of you will generally connect with procrastination. The second word associated is meant to wisely wait for the perfect opportunity. I personally like the second one. Here's the reason procrastination is so significant neuroscience has shown that there is a lot more happening in our brains when we procrastinate than simply putting off something and feeling terrible. I will explain the science in which I experience it so that when you put off accomplishing something you feel guilty about it. Don't you? That guilt is fundamental since it ensures that tasks stay on your mind which enacts the supersonic jigsaw puzzle this puzzle cycle happens in your brain at a supersonic speed nearly at a subconscious level that experience turns into a possible piece of that jigsaw in your subconscious which you rapidly examine every single piece turning them around and attempting to discover a few normal shapes or topics that could accommodate your riddle a few pieces may be discarded as unimportant others may be saved in case they fit a piece of the riddle some way or another until finally, you track down a significant piece and when that part slots into your puzzle out of nowhere you start the whole picture in the performance of a groundbreaking thought or a system from that point, every one of the bits of your supersonic jigsaw puzzle begins to come together. Salvador Dali Aristotle and numerous other creative geniuses understood the benefit of snoozing on. However, presently up until this point there are few models from some time in the past and that begs the question does the worth of procrastination actually still hold true today in your productivity obsessed modern world? It does so much so that some corporations actively create environments to encourage it innovative companies like Flickr and Live Fire foster play at work by encouraging games and having ping pong tables at the office on the surface of it it might just look like a waiter to create fun funky workplaces to attract talent. With some solitary time to think that small amount of peaceful aloneness gives your brains time to pull together all the pieces of your supersonic jigsaw puzzle. Now it can seem counterintuitive to encourage procrastination at work surely if people spend more time procrastinating than productivity or go down and so will profits yet research is showing us the opposite is true. When you procrastinate and provoke a little more imagination in your lives neuroscience is providing you with two or three clues about how you might enact that very sonic jigsaw puzzle. The first thing you want to do is procrastinate procrastination for a brief period. So we really want to procrastinate the procrastination sufficiently to make a little beginning on the task that may be simple as becoming clear about what you really want to do or simply writing down your initial few ideas. This gets your brain engaged in the challenge so the very sonic jigsaw puzzle can come to join the play you would rather not do a lot on it. Before you stop to procrastinate however in any case you risk becoming turning out to be excessively dedicated to your first idea. This behavior can close your brain to additional innovative solutions and that could be tragic. 
consider the possibility that if you miss a far more creative solution that had the potential to totally impact your reality. The second thing you want to do is distract yourself. Neuroscientists have shown that you want to procrastinate with things that are only a little distracting not excessively diverting. When you procrastinate with something that draws in your complete focus, the puzzle session slows down so you really want to procrastinate with things it leaves a little bit of space free in your mind to play with the supersonic jigsaw puzzle. Things like watching TED Talks cleaning or in any event, playing solitaire on the PC and undisputed top choice are fabulous methodologies for procrastination. The third thing you really want and perhaps the most basic thing is firm deadlines. You know from harsh experience that when you procrastinate without any timeline you never accomplish anything. So you really want those firm cut-off times to get your very sonic jigsaw puzzles focused on arranging the pieces. So assuming you as somebody that has battled with procrastination here's the uplifting news you can quit repressing it currently and rather be more purposeful and enjoy some productive procrastination. There are such countless difficulties in your reality some of which you people have battled with all through the ages. They won't be tackled utilizing conventional strategies you really want to release your imagination and track down new viable ways of getting through those obstructions. The power of procrastination lies in its ability to break the cycle of linear thinking and open our minds to unconventional solutions. If you have any desire to impact your reality for the better to develop the future you as a whole need to figure out how to procrastinate your direction to invent a virtuoso you. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel for more empowering content, and share it. Stay tuned for the next episode in this outstanding series on procrastination. If you guys like that feel free to share how you are planning to raise your standards I would love to know to feel free to ask questions or add a comment I'm happy to answer and I hope this was of value to you.